Okay, so in today's Daily Cyber, I'm going to be talking about information security management system. So let's hack at it. Okay, so let's talk about ISMS. Uh, I got some notes here. I'm just going to read from first just to kind of give you a definition of the information security management system. Is a framework for designing, establishing, implementing, maintaining, and monitoring an information security program in order to achieve the objective of confidentiality, integrity, and availability. So you're going to hear CIA constantly. If you're in the cybersecurity field, IT field, and you're talking about security, this CIA triad is always going to come up when they when you talk about the theory, the overview of security. So when you're looking at protecting your confidentiality of information the integrity of your environment, uh, and you're looking at the integrity and the confidentiality of personal information, uh, banking information, personal, you know, PII, personal identifiable information, right across the board. You want to maintain this confidentiality. Then the integrity, integrity of your company, integrity of your files, integrity of your data, um, the integrity of your employees. You want to always have that. And then now the availability and accessibility of you know information and data right you want to make sure that it's confident uh, it's confidential it's 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 intact which is like integrity and then you look at the availability can you get access to it when you need access to it so this could be through cloud solutions through VPN you know even just through your in your internal network when you're trying to access files and data can you get access when you need access to it and is it in a secure manner so your IS you know, MS program is to look at designing that, establishing that in a very concise manner, right? Now, you, when you're looking at manage it, you want to make sure that it's efficient and it's cost effective to do that. Uh, when you're looking at implementing, you're looking at the resources, right? The resources to be able to do it to to deploy to test it, so proof of concept to test out that technology, that solution. Uh, then you want to look at the resources and people and, and the budget to be able to deploy it and run it in your environment and make sure it runs in a secure manner. And then you look at maintaining. Can you maintain it? Can you patch it? Do you, do you have the available resources, people, right, manpower to be able to maintain that environment or do you need to hire someone else? right? And then monitoring, uh, as you guys know, is monitoring the technology so that it's not a set it and forget it and then you just kind of go back later going oh I didn't remember that we had that technology or we had that solution right? and this goes for governance as well policies procedures uh, governance no difference right making sure that you're, you're designing one that works for your company establishing you know really secure guidelines right and frameworks uh, implementing it and being able to deploy it throughout your company and making sure that people are aware of these policies and procedures and these governance right and maintaining it as it changes and it evolves right keeping it up to date and monitoring it on a consistent basis to make sure it's being followed so it's really important when you look at your organization doesn't matter if it's small to you know corporate level right you know fortune 500 it's so important to have an information security uh, management system in place and that it's monitored because the smaller companies that don't have this and larger companies you know time and time have these in place and have people that are doing this but when you look at the you know the SMB space that even to mid-sized companies that might have their IT person doing multiple jobs wearing multiple hats sometimes these are not in place or not monitored because they just don't have the time Right? They don't have the availability to be able to do it because they're so deep in projects and everything else to take on another uh, responsibility sometimes gets pushed away because we're doing it good enough. It's okay. And I'm telling you right now, as you know, and this is kind of an education to go forward just to share with the community, we have to do more. We have to be more consistent when it comes to cybersecurity. Right? And we have to do the things that are essential to protecting our business, protecting our, our employees, protecting our clients, protecting our brand, like right across the board. And it's so important to do these things day in and day out, month to month, because you know security is always evolving, technology is always evolving, it's always changing. 
and it's so important that we stay up to date with these and that's where you know reviewing your ISMS program consistently uh, in your framework you know at least on a month to month basis at least right to make sure it's up to date and you're keeping a track on track of it and making sure it's being you know monitored and maintained so that if you need to refer back to it, if you need to go back to it, you have that information. So that's all I really wanted to say about the ISMS uh, program right now. If you have any questions, let me know. Comment below. Uh, these are things I just I'm talking about as I'm going through, and really trying to uh, elaborate on the things that I find that are essential. That through conversations, through talking to people, you start to hear where things are being missed because evolution of technology, working on different things, working on different you know projects, uh, cost, time, and then you look at the essentials that sometimes got missed because they're so busy doing everything else. So these are things I'm just sending out as a reminder from all size companies, from small companies to large corporations, just rem reminding you guys that the things that we need to start to look at and make sure we're on point on consistently and ongoing. So that's it for today's video. Uh, comment below. I'd love to hear what you think uh, about ISMS and just you know how's that programming going uh, program going for you? Do you have one in place? Do you have any questions about it? Uh, so that's it again for this video. Don't forget, software's hackle. Being connected is vulnerable. I'll see you next video.